Yeah, what's up guys, Growing the Hobby coming back to you guys with another Turn Back Tuesday break. A Turn Back Tuesday baseball break, hopefully a little bit of redemption here from the last one of these that we did. I told you guys I would get more because I'm determined to find this card, so I did get some more. Let's see if you can figure out what the card is that we're going to be looking for, what we're going to be breaking based on the background cards, guys. So I'll throw you for a little loop again here. On the left side, my 1986 Fleer Michael Jordan PSA 5 rookie card. I'm going to throw him up right there. On the right side, uh, I'm not sure, Stadium Sports 93-94. It's kind of a weird uh, card, but it's really one of the only ones I have in baseball. Rookie of the Year, Michael Jordan. Uh, baseball card there for the White Sox. You guys can check that out if you haven't seen those before. That's what we got going on there. Throw that right there. Center stage, we're going to leave wide open for hopefully a nice pull today because I want to pull... A Jordan, if you haven't figured that out. And we're going to try and pull one from another sealed box of 1991 Upper Deck uh, Baseball here. That's right, guys. We are looking for the Michael Jordan short print. Um, looking for that red kind of jersey and white pants that he has on the pitcher. Uh, I believe it's just SP1 is the numbering and stuff like that. But we're looking for it. I already broke a box of this. Did not get one. Um, and I, when I, everything that I've read about this and reading the odds and you know blogs and stuff like that, um, it looks like you get one of those roughly per, per every two hobby boxes. So this will be my second hobby box. Hopefully we get lucky enough to pull it out of this one today. So it's going to be a lot of cards to get through. I'm not going to lie, guys. Um, it's kind of a pain in the butt. Uh, if you didn't see my other video and stuff, we're going to fly through it. I'm going to fly through it even faster in that other video because it's just a ton of cards. We've got 36 packs we're going to have to get through. And upper deck, you think it's bad with tops with turning the cards upside down on stuff like that? upper deck is worse uh it is an absolute nightmare to turn around all of these cards so i'm not going to do it we're just going to fly through it we're looking for that red jersey white pants michael jordan but here you go guys we're just going to get right into it um and hopefully get a little bit of luck um and you can this is the find the nola uh find the nolan uh, promotion in here, so you're looking for like a Nolan Ryan autograph is thrown in here, and I'll take a look at this card only for the fact that I don't think I pulled this the last time. Uh, stolen base leaders with Lou Brock there, nice, nice, pretty cool looking card. But uh, yeah, guys, there's a Wade Boggs. I'll point out some of these guys as we get through them. Um, you know, they're maybe worth mentioning really quickly, um, and then you're going to get one of these per per pack as well. Those stickers. Uh, checklist cards are yep checklist will be back guys we'll see a few checklist cards i really hope that we get the michael jordan in here otherwise i'm going to be back to buying another box of this uh, right after this video and we will revisit this uh in the future for sure because i'm determined to pull a michael jordan um, sp1 baseball card out of this so we will see guys we will see like I said, it does take some time, 36 packs, obviously times, you know, I don't know what it is, 12 or 14 cards per pack, you know, something like that. It's it's a lot of cards, there's a lot of cards. I will be left with a huge stack of cards uh, at the end of this video to kind of sort through and stuff. There's a nice Nolan Ryan, I will stop and point that out. Nice Nolan Ryan card there, one of the greatest uh players in baseball history especially as far as a pitcher goes not going to get much better than that uh, let's see what we got here i might honestly guys uh if i don't pull the jordan today i might um well i know i'm going to get more boxes like i said that's weird two jack clarks back to back um I might wait until we get to the 1,000 subscriber kind of video because I'm kind of playing that out, guys, as we're approaching this. Um, and I think I'm going to do a live stream just to kind of give you guys a little heads up as to what I'm thinking. I'm going to do a live screen, stream, give away some prizes um, during the live stream as well as prizes uh, that I'm going to kind of set up with links and other videos and stuff like that, which we'll do some drawings of. And again, guys, Jerome Walton back-to-back, -back, that's weird. Um, I could only get so lucky as to get a Jordan back-to-back -back like that. Um, but anyway, um, 
I want to do a live stream at least for a couple hours uh, with you guys um, so we can kind of shoot the bull and stuff like that. And this would be a product that would be really ideal for that because it's just kind of not a lot to point out. You know, I mean, there are some good players, don't get me wrong, and stuff like that. But we're looking for one player here. So it does kind of drag it out and make it a little bit longer sometimes. Um, so it would be nice to be able to interact with you guys rather than just kind of sitting here and talking to myself um, as I make these videos and stuff. So I may save the possible redemption box. Redemption, redemption box, I guess, because it would be the third box. I may save that for the 1,000 subscriber live stream. Uh, but we'll see. We'll see. Hopefully it doesn't come to that because I'd love to pull one today. And I don't think we're going to have it there. Oh, it's just so many packs. So many packs. It's a daunting task, guys. It really is. Um, as much as I want to fly through this, and I am trying to fly through it, it still, I feel like, just takes forever, guys. It really does. Um, and knowing my luck, I'll fly through these somehow and not even notice that I just whizzed right by the Michael Jordan or something like that. Um, if I do, please tell me. I mean, I'll check these out after for myself, but uh, if that would happen for some crazy reason, please let me know <laughs> in, the, in the description or in the, uh, in the comment section of the video, guys. And you can tell me how dumb I am for flying right through the card. Um, here we go. Tom Glavin, that's, that's nice. Not his rookie or anything like that, but still nice. Sid Bream. All right. If you guys have any suggestions, actually... Within reason, within reason, that's the caveat to this. But if you guys have any suggestions as far as um, products you'd like me to break for these Turn Back Tuesdays, um, feel free to let me know in the comments or send me um, an email, which is always in the description of all my videos. Um, I have a lot of stuff that I'm going to break for these Turn Back Tuesdays that I'm sitting on right now um, that we'll kind of get to and some good things that I'm looking forward to getting to, but... Um, I'm always open to ideas and suggestions. Again, though, within reason, I'm not, you know, for example, going to pick up like a hobby box of, you know, 1955 tops or something like that. Um, yeah, it's got to be financially possible here for me. So, um, definitely not having any luck yet. The Save Master there. I've not pulled that one yet. The Save Master. Bobby Thigpen. Interesting. I'm sorry if you... I don't know if you guys can pick up on this or not. Uh, there's a little bit of noise outside. There's some kids playing and stuff like that. I try to do these videos as best I can with kind of noise reduction and things, but uh, sometimes things are unavoidable. So I'm not sure if you guys are picking up on that. I can hear it here, but I don't know if you guys are picking up on it in the video. If you are, I apologize. But um, uh, again, look at this, guys. Andy Hawkins back-to-back. -back. How many packs, I wonder... You know, do they do that in it? Like, is that a, a standard thing? I don't remember coming across this issue uh, in the first box of this I broke for you guys on here. Um, where you get, like, back-to-back -back cards, you know, endlessly. Uh, they're the same player and stuff. But uh, I don't know. Maybe that was standard. And it's, you know, I just didn't notice it in the first video. I don't know. There's a, a Baseball Heroes. Uh, Nolan Ronoff. That's 14 of 18. It's not the header card. You're looking for... If you're looking for anything in that set, you're looking for the header card or the uh, Nolan Ryan autograph itself. Those are the two big ones in there. I mean, I think any of those are still worth like a buck or so. But uh, the header card and the autograph is obviously the money cards. Um, so here we go. Just not having much luck. And it's a very frustrating break i know i already told you guys but i'm going to say it again it's it's frustrating because of the cards being turned every single which way possible and you know let's just be honest the the other cards in here other than if you're pulling like a nolan ryan autograph or something like that the other cards in this set are just not uh they don't have you know high values or anything like that nice fred mcgriff there um but 
again guys look at that um so it's not like you know you want to slow down and really be like oh okay cool check out you know i'm looking for you know any one of 10 cards or something like that because no it really is just one card that you're looking for unless you come across a card that has some ink on it meaning an autograph of nolan ryan so and again guys especially with these cards being turned every which way it is very very frustrating um another nolan ryan one there that's a 10 of 18 And nothing there. And you see what I'm saying, guys? We're already about 11 minutes into this video, and we're, I want to say, halfway done. I, I, I hope. I hope we're at least halfway done. Um, it's just, there's a Cal Ripken Jr. upside down. Uh, No, nothing. Nothing still. We might not get the odds, guys, of the one in one in every two of these boxes having that. I might not meet the odds. Um, you can't expect to have the odds every time, that's for sure. Uh, I was really hoping, though, that we could get this. I mean, it's funny with all the with all of the money that I'll spend on these, even though they're fairly cheap. Because um, I'll be honest, these are around... Hey, you still get them for less than 50 bucks a box at least as of this recording you know 40 or 50 bucks is roughly what you're looking at to buy one of these boxes so i mean they're still affordable but you know now two boxes figure a hundred dollars into that i mean i could have just bought a raw michael jordan but i just wanted to have the fun of actually being able to pull one for myself which i thought would be fairly achievable even though it's an sp um just based on the stuff that i read I thought that uh, it would be achievable, but it's looking like I'm wrong so far. Wrong so far. All right. Ozzy Canseco there, Ken Caminetti, Cubs card. Williams. Well, I'm just going to empty this box because I feel like I'm going to start knocking things over. Plus, it'll give us an easy way to see how many packs we got left. So, there's the empty box. Put that over there. And we're left with these still. Um, which is going to be... We're definitely over halfway done, so that's good. Um, eight. Maybe about 16 packs to go. So, a little over halfway done. Again, guys, I'm flying through this as best I can. Because I know it can be boring. Um, unless you get the card that we're looking for, the card that we came to see, which I'm still holding on hope for, obviously, guys. Oh, there we go. That's actually nice, though. Top prospect card of Chipper Jones. That's pretty cool. Definitely our best, best pull of this break. I did not pull that in the first box, um, either when I did this, so that's actually pretty nice. Let's see what we have in the next pack, once we eventually get it open. And baseball here is 11 on that one, guys. Carlton Fisk there. It's pretty cool. Hall of Famer. And that one is 17 of 18. That threw me for a minute, honestly, even though it's the Expos. Saw that big red jersey. I said, oh, do we? But no. That is a not, uh, obviously, Michael Jordan. The bashing year is Mark McGuire. Come on, come on. Jim Abbott? Yeah, nice. Strange you see him as the uh, the batting card there, not pitching and stuff. And you guys remember him uh, not having a right hand? You guys can clearly see that there. Very neat card. Uh, was a heck of a pitcher. Uh, 
that's a really neat card actually I'm setting that aside if you didn't notice so I'm gonna keep that one I think in the uh, the PC that's a really cool card John Crook Gary Scott I appreciate you guys hanging in there with me in this hunt for the Michael Jordan short print. Like I said, guys, I know it's not the funnest uh, video and stuff like that because there's not a lot of highlights, even though we've gotten a couple that I did not get in that first box. Uh, I do not recall coming across that Jim Abbott in the first box. And there's a Deion Sanders, actually. Deion Sanders card there. Um, but I do not recall coming across... Uh, that Jim Abbott card or the Chipper Jones prospect card in the first box. So those were at least a nice little variation from the first box. That Chipper Jones is going to have some value to it for sure. All right, guys. Kurt Gibson. Herbie Puckett. Uh, Dante Bichette. Barry Larkin. there Rob Dibble Bo Jackson there and that is 14 of 18 on that one Donnie Baseball Don Mattingly there uh, I thought it was stuck to something but it's not Nope, no go in that one. I don't know, guys. I feel like we might get skunked and we might not have the odds with us here with the, one of those cards in uh, every two boxes. I, I don't know that we're going to have that luck with us. Uh, Randy Johnson. Is that Sammy Sosa? I just kind of flew right by. Yeah, there you go. There's a Sammy Sosa. Slamming Sammy. Ozzy Smith. Nice Reggie Sanders prospect. Right. Getting down to the nitty gritty, guys. Uh, Ken Griffey Sr. Checklist. Uh, Gary Sheffield, Michael Vallier, Spanky Lavalier, actually. Uh, Sean Barry, Brent Main. Final looks like, uh, including this one, six packs. So, 30 packs in, and no such luck, guys. No such luck yet. Uh, I'm still holding out on a little bit of luck, but I don't know. That, uh, that hope is dwindling again rapidly. Very, very rapidly. Lenny Dykstra, Todd Zeal, Bernie Williams. That's a Rico Brogna. I don't know, guys. Next time I break this, if we don't pull this today, I think I might have to get like a a rabbit's foot um, horseshoe, four leaf clover. Might really just have to load up with some bringing us some luck because we're not having it so far with uh, with this. All right. Doo -doo -doo. Larry Walker, actually, there, guys. Um, that I kind of paused on there. Sorry, I didn't really turn it around and stuff. Doesn't have tremendous value to it, but I uh, did want to point that out. Don Slot. Last three packs, guys. Last three packs. Will we have the baseball gods with us at all today? I don't feel that we will. There's Bobby Witt. You guys should recognize that name. He'll be the father of Bobby Witt Jr. Junior Ortiz. Nope. 
Last two. And I will say, guys, if you go out and try and do this or buy these yourself, you want to buy the upper deck box that I showed you guys at the beginning of this video. I can show you again real quick after these last couple packs. You do not want the um, upper deck box that says find the Aaron. You want the one that says find the Nolan because find the Aaron does not have the Michael Jordan SP in it. So, um, and they tend to be a little bit cheaper and that's the reason why. Um, and also at the same time, some people though, they don't know try and take advantage like the flippers and the shady people on the internet will kind of try to play it off like the Jordans in there, but that's not the right set. And there we go. We finish with the save master there, guys. Uh, Bobby Thigpen again. So yeah, there you go, guys. I think the best card of the break easily. Probably this Chipper Jones top prospect card. We'll just throw that up there. We'll sleeve it up after the video, but I hope you guys enjoyed it. And again, the box that you're looking for, I know it's a little sideways, but there it is right there. The find the Nolan, that's what you're looking for, not find the Aaron, um, as far as the Michael Jordan SP goes. But yeah, guys, please leave a like, subscribe, share if you don't mind. Click that bell notification button to be notified of future videos. Lots more of them coming to you guys still for sure. Um, I hope you guys are enjoying these Turn Back Tuesday breaks as well as all the breaks on this channel. I'm trying to bring you guys some nice variation in products. And have quite a bit of fun with you guys. Um, again, as always, in the description, you guys can find my email address as well as a mailing address uh, if you ever need to reach out to me. But other than that, guys, have a great day, a great night, wherever you guys are at. And we will see you guys next time.